Several big announcements from Evansville Mayor Stephanie Terry today. The city has a new police and a new fire chief, too. Mitch Carter was there for the announcement. He joins us now. Well, Randy, on the police side of things, Billy Boland's now out in his place as his former assistant chief, a mentee and friend, Philip Smith. I am pleased to introduce Philip Smith as the next chief of the Evansville Police Department and Anthony Knight as the chief of the Evansville Fire Department. Big changes in Evansville. On Monday, Mayor Stephanie Terry named her new police and fire chief. Over on EPD's side, Billy Boland will be replaced by somebody who he says he holds a great amount of respect for, as evident by both men's reaction during new police chief Philip Smith's speech. Uh, lastly, I want to thank Chief Billy Boland. Yeah, Billy, I'm going to do this without crying. <laughs> chief Boland has been a trailblazer, and he has led EB through, uh, EPD through some of the toughest times of our profession and that our profession has ever faced. He's been a leader, he's been a visionary, a mentor, and more importantly, a friend. I, I aspire to live up to the legacy that you leave behind. So, thank you. In a lot of ways, you know, I should be jumping over the moon, but it's a little bittersweet, uh, to be honest, because uh, the person that's no longer chief is uh, a one of my best friends and a mentor. A veteran of the police force, including roles in special projects, and of course, his most recent position as assistant chief, Smith says he's no stranger to what's asked of the chief, and it's something he's ready for. And uh, I, I just have to know in my heart and in my spirit and be at peace with the fact that he's prepared me as best he can. He believes in me. Uh, Mayor Terry believes in me, and um, I have to believe in myself and know that I have the ability to do this job. Hearing his name read for the first time by the mayor as chief of police, though he's had multiple mentors who have gotten him ready for the moment, is still special. To see those folks who have invested all that time into me and poured everything into me out there, was it was a weak in the knees moment. And then I look over just a little bit to the left and I lock eyes with Billy. Oh, then I almost lost it, man. You know, the, I'm looking out at family. So you're freshly appointed. What's next? We come walking back in from lunch, and there's this whole stack of papers laying there that normally I have to sign, says chief of police. I'm like, hey, here you go. Sign these. Yeah, he's, he's been passing off the book. <laughs> well, outside of paperwork, Smith says a lot of the goals remain the same, continuing community outreach and ensuring that he, along with the mayor's office, can provide the safest city possible for the people of Evansville. Well, Chief Smith tells me he will have a new assistant chief appointed by the end of the week, if all goes according to plan. As for Boland, we were able to sit down with him and recap his 12 years of service and what it means to see Smith take over just like he was hoping for. We'll have that story tomorrow right here on 14 News. All right, Mitch.